There we go. No, this is this is a brand new game uh, that's obviously very, very inspired by Wonder Boy. No, now I've got a lot of damage boosting. Uh, what did you pick up? A herb. Went into a oh, cave okay. for it. Yeah, because there's at least a person that gives you herbs for free. Exactly. So that's nice. But that means that I now have a lot of damage boosting I can do. Yeah, I feel like there's going to be a very interesting balance between health and armor. Uh, damage boosting because early on you can damage boost all over the place but it uh, gets way harder really fast yeah oh wait i can go through this shortcut right i can't do this picking up a herb is not planning for failure planning for damage boosts. <laughs> Thank you very much, Author Blues. I don't have enough money for anything. Later. Adventure Friend! I'm so excited for you. Well, I, I, I found Adventure Friend. Now I'm playing as Adventure Friend. Oh, yeah. Yeah, now you're going on a real adventure. Adventure Friend cannot jump, nor can he double jump. That oh, is true. that's what these are for. I was wondering. I, I was staring at these holes, just assuming they weren't going to be anything for a while. It's not quite as good as a transformation, but still. Oh, Adventure Friend? Yeah, because in Shanta you can just turn into the monkey. What did you end up setting up as your splits? Just everything? Yeah, I've got a lot of stuff that's set up as splits right now. Yeah, I can't go up that way, so I'll definitely go down this way. Oh, I wonder if I could set up for a death warp. Probably. After I get the uh, mole you... seal, that would be real cool. Yeah, you, you maintain a lot of progress in this game once you yeah. die. Yeah, I haven't, like, I all of my routing, I haven't stuff. even thought about, like, death warping or anything yet. Yeah, I haven't really mapped it out. I do know what I wanted to do was just see a giant map of where all Yeah, the I can't wait for somebody is. to do that. I'm definitely not going to be the yeah. person who does it, though. Oh, 
Oh, let's go in the bar, maybe? Oh, right, because there was a hole up here. This is a really clever section, honestly. I mean, there's a lot of really clever sections. That's true. I don't remember what was down that way. I feel bad. This is a waste of time. This is not going to be a good PB. <laughs> Yo, DC Bartlett and Divine Moogle, how's it going? Unfortunately, it's going to be a PB. God willing. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> You end up spending like 17 hours on the final barely. boss this time. <laughs> yeah, Media Magnet, this game is really fun. It is super worth your time. I can agree with that. And I definitely think it's going to be one of those games where, like, when I'm not figuring out the puzzles and it's just the movement and execution, I'm going to have so much fun with it. Yeah. And most of the puzzles I figure out pretty quick, but it was just those two. <laughs> two very specific puzzles. Yeah, the game probably said hello. Oh, I don't know, I'm mashing. Yay, I have oh, a key. Wait, what oh, shoot. I'm, I'm going to assume he said take him back to the forest, because I didn't read that. Uh, he said, take me back to my home. I don't actually remember how to get there. What are you looking for? Uh, the Earth Temple. Uh, that one's down and to the right. Uh, through the forest. If I remember correctly. Thousand more money to go. <laughs> oh my gosh, this route is so good. Yeah, you just like end up naturally coming back here. That's real nice. Hello. Take two of your equipment, please. <laughs> so I, I just dropped an adventure friend back, and I walked over to talk to the pink one. He stole from me. I talked to her, and then she, they stole from me like four times, talked to the two of them. <laughs> yeah, that'll happen. I feel like this is incorrect. I'm already lost. Well, already ruined the PB preset. This is... this is a problem with these games. I had the same problem with my initial runs of um... Wonder Boy. Wonder Boy, yeah, where I was like, oh no, I don't remember how to get to the next thing. <laughs> yeah, I Water think has very slightly different physics. Yeah, just a tiny bit. Yeah, that's real subtle. Oh, oh, you just go through those, eh? That's cool. Cool. What? The snake just goes through stuff. That's right, I had the key. Now I... <laughs> Big oop. Head to that air temple. Which is probably gonna ruin me because I don't have the lightning armor yet. Yeah, I'm questioning whether or not I'm gonna ever pick up the lightning armor in any of the in the any percent speedrun. Smart. Yeah, because you you fairly easily get enough money to get one of the two. Yeah. And sword's gonna be just better, but. Yep. 
And I'm, I, I've already figured out a route for, um, like, just getting the Celestial gear real quick. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, in that case, definitely don't bother with the lightning stuff. Unless yeah. for some reason you feel like you need uh, one of the Rude. people who, uh, if you feel like you need it for a specific reason or quest. No. 100 Bruce. <clears throat> I think I might finally be coming down with AGD flu, and it's been like a week. That sucks. Oh no! Yeah, not a fan. Um, anyway, for 100% obviously we're gonna need it, but... Oh yeah, because 100% is actually a thing. Can be. Well, I mean, there's actually a percentage, and it tells you... Oh yeah, you. yeah, the game gives you... It's not like arbitrary get everything, it's yeah. actually... Did you ever figure out what that one mouse is? Yeah, I know what it is. Oh, nice. It's gonna take forever for people to find. I'm really looking forward to uh, to hearing about how long it took everyone. <laughs> Rude. My my theory, and I have no proof for this one way or the other, is that it's uh, in the dark room. Uh, which dark room? Uh, the one where you get the lyre string. I mean, do you want me to tell you whether or not you're correct? I know the answer. Uh, nah. Okay. I'll probably go looking for it after I end up beating this. Yeah, it's it. It's a thing that when you fight it, you're like, oh, oh my, you uh, you weren't fucking around here, eh? <laughs> Whoa! Did I just? Huh. That was weird. Don't care. Bodied by this dungeon. Which I need to figure out the moon thing uh, next. Okay. Because I kind of, I kind of want to figure out where oh, to get come on. the next That's... Like, actual armor. Yeah, divine moveable. Everybody who did the blind race who finished uh, got all of the enemies except for that one on their completion. Probably super rude, I'm sure. Yeah, it's definitely an enemy that you have to fight. <laughs> it's definitely a thing with hit points, for sure. Yeah, it has hit points. Don't care. Oh, what was Melos's final time? Uh, he was like an hour quicker than me. He was quick. Okay. I'm getting a ton of money from the enemies in here. I'm pretty much just going to grind for 8,000 and uh, <laughs> keep dying. Or I could figure out where the uh, the moon the moon thing needs to get handed in to continue that quest. Yeah, I forgot where it had to get handed in when I did it. And then when I when I was realized or when I realized and was reminded, uh, it was both. Uh, it was like, <laughs> goddamn. Yeah, because I found I found the shell one really quick. Um, like I found the shell when I was reinvestigating the underwater area for the feather. Uh, yes, this is extremely Wonder Boy inspired. How's it going, Grim Seventy Five? Come on, give me some. I think, I think I'm just going to have to go through every village and talk to everyone again to figure out that boom bit. Shouldn't get the Hako FX888D as your primary soldering iron. 
Uh, I wish that I could tell you. I, I wish that I could say I have, you know, lots of opinions on what good soldering equipment is, but I don't. only complaint about this game so far is that I'm being forced to play with the analog stick. Yeah, that is pretty awkward. For somebody who's used to not the analog stick, yeah. Oh, hey! I forgot about that. But there's a item for completionism in there. Oh, save point. Thank goodness. Yeah, those are, they're placed in relatively good spots overall. Yeah, I just found the one right before the uh, air temple. Oh, right on. Which is hilarious, because I'm just about to leave, because I almost have the 80,000. Yeah, that was the last one for me to find. The one in the air temple? Yeah. Or, I'm sorry, I thought you said water. Uh, no. Probably no, 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 because no. I am currently going to the water temple. <laughs> yeah, I, I also missed the one in the water temple. Yeah, it's way out of the way. You would not just naturally find it unless you're exploring. Hey, we got the AK. Hey. Now let's do some side quests, because I'm getting bodied. That, and I kind of want to see what the, uh, the eel says when I electrify everything around me. Do you have both? Yeah, I have both. Yeah, it's... It's a tree. Where is the eel, anyway? I never found it. Uh, I will no, let fine. you know as soon as I find it again, but it's... Uh, I ended up finding it backtracking Hello, with guard. The I hope nothing bad ever happens to you. Bye, guard. <laughs> I'm sure... Ooh, that's really cool. Shopkeeps will tell you stuff that isn't just buy my things. Anything else in here, though? Oh, and funny enough, you can't use fire underwater to the surprise of no one. Yeah. When you try and use fire underwater, the game's just like, what were you even thinking there, buddy? <laughs> Why, friend? Why? It's a cute idea and all, but have you considered... no. Okay, so when you first enter the abyss area, not the... not the water temple Not the water itself, temple itself. Yeah, like, you, you go through the door that you have to translate. Yeah. If you drop down, Definitely. after not too far, you'll see an area that opens to the right with spikes above and below it. Yeah. If you work your way through that, you'll find the eel. Okay. And uh, the other side ends up being fairly close to the, the temple itself. Yep, 
that is exactly what I need to do. Now he is overjoyed. And he's going back home. Let's see, where's the other side spit you out? I think the other side is like right next to the water temple. Unless lightning has another effect, the uh, lightning sword is technically an upgrade to the bubble sword. Yeah. No, it is. Uh, underwater, it is still a strict upgrade. Okay, so from the water temple, if you drop it down, Fine, actually. it's like an upward area. Just If you just drop down out of the water temple, you'll okay. see an area with that heads up with spikes on the left and right. Yeah. Uh, that's also right next to the Oh, and I'm gonna get this coral armor, because I think I can afford it. And, because I can. I'm gonna play with that when I'm not in the middle of a run, but I'm pretty sure that's doable. Uh, what are you trying to do? Uh, damage boost to skip a, an underwater segment. Oh, nice. I tried to do it before, uh, during my blind playthrough, and I spent a lot of time failing. Like, you go with decent ways on damage boost, so there's some, like, really small ones I managed to pull off, but none that actually, you know, progressed yeah. or were sequence breaks. I'm trying to find the uh, save spot underwater. Mostly to just find stuff and figure out where on earth I need to hand in this moon. Because mm. I don't recall anyone in the entire game talking about a moon, and I've been pretty good about uh, talking to people. The no. sage might also tell me now that I think about it. Okay. I need to remember that next time. Actually go talk to the dude before I go to the top of the library. Oh, yeah, because I think you need to start the quest. Yeah. First. Yeah, I forgot about it being a quest. Yeah, the quests in this game are, like, really short lived. <laughs> wow, I still cannot find the save in here. I'm sure that doesn't have anything to do with the moon thing. Alright. Did that during my blind fight as well. Yeah, I mean, really everything about this game is cute. It's a just a really good game. Yeah, it really is. Super solid mechanics and everything. Okay, so that actually interrupts your animation. Alright, 
I feel like I should add a universal book split there. about this mouse being hidden in here. Because now I want to know. <laughs> Before I do that, I'll go buy me a bubble sword. I'm noticing this game is actually really, really good about pacing out your gold. Found it! Nice. Pacing out your what? Your gold. I have mm. not felt broke. Just running. So far. Yeah, I did feel like they did a really good job pacing it out. Um, now that you mentioned I am curious to see how it feels from a speedrunning perspective, too. But usually these games are pretty good about stuff like that, just because they have very harsh cutoff points. Yeah. So just the tiers of money that you have at one point or the next. Ah, uh, I see. I see where that eel is. Also, this mouse is really cleverly hit. Also, I'm really glad I was right. Yeah. <laughs> Yes to both of those. Also, it might just rickety wreck me. Yeah. Right now. Yeah, that's that's kind of the thing. Is like that. That mouse sure is. It sure is. <laughs> it sure is a thing. Oh god, I'm out of magic. Whoa. Okay, I'm coming back later. Yeah. I was not expecting multiple attack patterns from a gosh darn mouse. Yeah, it's... <laughs> it's a thing, right? <laughs> that jump. See, I was just expecting some, like, meek little thing in a corner. I wasn't expecting an actual, like, mid-boss. Oh, you're gonna love the name when, um... Oh, when it pops up? When it pops up. I hope it's, like... I, I want one of two things. I want it to be, like, either a single letter or, like, a grandiose name that's, like, 20 words long. It's neither of those. I'm sorry to tell you. Ah, oh, bummer. I'm st still. sure it's still amazing. When you see it, you'll be like, yeah, yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, this guy's not telling me where the next trade quest is. What do you have? The moon. Okay. Well, I can tell you, you definitely have encountered the place to use that. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I feel like I've been pretty much everywhere. Oh, the princess gives you hearts every time you talk to her now. Yeah. No, I've done that twice! Why am I bad at video games? Uh... That is a good question. Please stop. Please stop taking stupid damage. I'm literally going for the save point so that I can refill my health. Taking more damage is not what I need right now. <laughs> is it this way? It might be this way. Thank God. Later, losers! Oh god. Oh god. Owned! I Find something interesting? Nope. Nope, I'm just getting owned. Oh, I thought you said, oh. No, I said, I'm getting owned. Oh. 
I forget the exact entrance to the water temple. I think it's the jump that I was screwing up. And I'm pretty well set up for... I guess I'm... I am going to go back into that save point and get my health back. Um, but I'm pretty well set up for a, a level up mid thing. Mid dungeon. Oh yeah, the experience routing in this game is going to be really interesting. Yeah, that aspect of it is going to be very uh, similar to uh, Zelda 2. Yeah. We're going to have to care about that. I don't think I've had to really worry about a proper experience route before. Oh look, it's one of those merman assholes. No one likes those. I've got to be careful though. Like, I have to watch my experience and only take level ups when... I'm low on health. Yeah, that's gonna be real finicky. Yeah, this is... I mean, it's a really cool consideration. Do you know if, um... So when you kill a boss, you get a health restore, right? Yes. I'll take that. Oh man, next thing Do you know if kill... you get experience from killing the little guys during a boss? Uh, I don't believe so. It hasn't looked like it. Merman fight time. You're gonna level me up, which stinks. I guess I'll... You know what? I'm just gonna, I'm gonna tank you. Because it doesn't matter. Yeah, Austin Spafford. You're definitely not wrong there. Yo, Tristan. Yeah, this is pretty much Wonder Boy. Not that way. Fairly good rendition of Wonder Boy, too. Yeah. Yeah, the Agalos team did a really good job. This game is just spectacular. So, I blind played through this game last night, and now I'm... <laughs> I mean, I'm not blind, but it's not like I have the route memorized at all. I did a little bit of uh, naive routing before I started streaming today. Oh yeah, what did you end up routing in that anyway? Uh, really, it's just the order of everything that I was uh, okay. working on. That's gonna suck. Just real basic. Yeah. Stuff. Yeah, nothing super hardcore, but. Oh dear. Why does everything hit like a truck here? Even with samurai armor, which is arguably like better than I'm supposed to have. I don't have any item of royalty. You still trying to figure out the moon? Yeah, I'm still trying to figure out the moon. Alright. I'm basically going from town to town to town. Okay, that was neat. I managed to get the game to give me a jump. Out of damage okay. boost. Oh, nice. Does damage boost thing reset your uh, jump? Uh, it doesn't appear to. Okay. Because I know it's very strict about uh, how many times you can up slash. Like, even transitioning screens doesn't reset your up slash. Yeah, I know. I've noticed. I know that because I found it out during my blind playthrough and I was really disappointed because that seems very exploitable. Thank God for all these heart drops.
I'm basically trying to do two things right now. I'm trying to find the moon, and I'm trying to find the fountain. Hey, the mass 3212. Thank you very much for the 20 bits. Oh, is that is that so, Austin? Um, I would love to know why. I never once used it in my blind playthrough. Oof. What did you never use in your blind playthrough? Bubble armor. I'm being told that the bubble armor is superior in this dungeon. I get it. I let um, me go. Maybe it does water resistance? Oh, yeah, the coral armor is plus 26 underwater. Oh. And the samurai okay. armor is plus 22. Okay, it's just that makes more sense then. That's The just... coral armor is also cheaper than the samurai armor, too, so... Yeah, but I, I routed in the samurai armor. armor. I never routed in buying the coral armor. It's definitely not a detour. It's right there, so... Yeah, I know. I mean work. money route. But it oh, should oh. still be fine. I thought you were just talking theoretical. Yeah. yeah, it's just right there, so it won't be a problem. I think that... I'm gonna make some changes to my config. I think I like the air on the shoulder button. I don't think that I like the... Um... I know where you I need to go, I just don't remember the route to get there. Hey, I finally killed an Onyx. Nice. I, just I the ended up just time. skipping past all of those because... <laughs> because no. Because they're super rude. Yeah. I did exactly the same when I first came through here. So is the person you have to talk to for the moon thing in a town at least? No. Okay. That could explain why I've been having trouble finding them. I did the same thing that you're probably doing. I went to, like, every town possible. Yeah, that's what I was doing. Right. Now what I'm doing is I'm going through, uh... the areas trying to find the fountain. I keep going right, but I'm not seeing anything that's new or a fountain. Yeah, the fountain I actually didn't find until I got a hint. What was the hint? Do you want me to... It, the hint is basically a spoiler. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm fine with a hint. Alright. So, you will find this out from one of the villagers that I never talked to. Um, they tell you that the fountain is in... Um, what's it called? It's in the mountains. Hmm, okay. So, I'm, I'm on the right track. I just can't find it. Yeah, because I talked to the villager that says it's, you know, near this village. Which kind of leaves only a few options. And it's not where the string is, so I'll have to look around. So this one first. It's not this one first. Same problem last time that I went through this section. I feel real 
real dumb soon. That's why I'm gonna feel dumb. Oh, wow. I don't know what they're called, but these, like, ghost people are really rude trying to get through this area. Already been open. I don't think that I did this, but I've got a fall. Come on. See if I can't do this. I know that there's got to be an easier way. Hmm. Nope, this area is still just a heart piece. Not sure how I'm missing this. Because I'm exploring all through the mountain. Almost level 13 now. I don't remember how I did that during my blind playthrough. Oh, I just jump out of the water using the bubble. doesn't involve breaking a specific ice block up here, does it? No. Okay. Because I'm chilling all through the mountain. I cannot find it. I'm just going where I've been already, but no fountain. It's not sealed in Valiant's castle, is it? No, it is not. Okay. God, that would be a dick move. Well, I was just wondering if it was a thing that you needed to at least get all four elements for first. Uh, no. Oh, no. Shoot. Uh-oh, what'd you do? Ran out of magic. Oh, no! There's probably a jump or something that I'm just straight up missing. Something that'll be really obvious in hindsight. Because <laughs> I've gotten both the, the liar and the heart container from here. Do you want another hint? I would love another hint. It is inside a cave in the mountains. Okay. Okay, you know, that that was rude. Just overall. Uh, everything that happened there? Rude.
forth. I would not be surprised if I run past the fountain like three times already. Probably. Yeah. Because like all of the hints that you're giving are exactly where I've been looking. <laughs> all that gold. Oh wow, that sounds really nice, uh, Austin's backwards. obvious when I find it, I'm sure. And I even, like, see a little area, like, through the camera that makes it look like I should go down, but I can't tell if that's the previous room or if that's actually a thing in here. This would be so much more frustrating if I didn't have five magic right now. Mm. Just like exploring this cave over and over and over again. Speaking of things that I forgot to buy. Oh, the magic from the underwater area? Yeah. Makes sense. Almost gone from 13 to 14 trying to find this fountain. Yeah, DC Bartlett, I'm only level 6 right now. No, 
wrong way. Talk to you later. Please stay hydrated, Bob. Thanks for the Shout out to stay hydrated, Bob. You should probably stay hydrated. There's no good chance to take a drink in this game. <laughs> I believe it. Speaking of which... Oh, hey, the mass! Thank you very much for the 20 bits. Dude, it's delicious. Hey, uh, hey, Tina. Yeah. Could you give me a, uh, another hint? Okay. Uh, you know that, like, jumping puzzle, uh, you know where you push the big concrete block underwater? Yes. It is right near there. It is one of the caves in that upper screen. Ah, uh, okay. So it's the mountains to the left, not the mountains to the right. That yes. Yo, cool. oh, DC Bartlett, thank you so much for the 100 bits. It was extremely generous of you. Thank you. I guess I thought I explored all those caves already, but um, clearly yes. I didn't. Which, to be fair, there's a lot of the caves, so that doesn't really surprise me. But yeah, I was focusing on the, uh, the super difficult... Um, the super difficult jumping area in the ice caves to the right. That makes sense. That's why I couldn't find it. <laughs> hey, Omega, how's it going? There we go. I'm not level 6 anymore. I hope you're happier. Shoutouts to level 7. That would that would have put me at level 7 if the other thing didn't. <laughs> hey, Media Magnet, how's it going? stuff please thank you yeah this is pretty much get good percent you can open it up multi twitch yeah it's not a bad idea uh technically i picked up the race where i left off uh tina finished yesterday yeah oh my god how have i never gone into oh, this door Oops. And why would I not get Tira before? Please scroll. That seems silly. I can't believe I never went into this door. I thought this door was a different door. <laughs> no, I will not give it to you. Oh, Jesus. Menuing is really hard in this game. If you if you hit um, if you hit a direction and uh, select on the same, or maybe not even the same frame, um, but. Uh, it'll it'll double input your um, what's it called? It'll double input your direction, so it looks like you selected yes, but you selected no, and it really sucks. Yeah, that does sound pretty bad. Well, never gonna get that. That was super worthless. I'm guessing the. Since I clearly haven't explored these caves as thoroughly as I thought, I'm guessing the moon person is around these caves, too. Uh, do you want a hint for that? I would love a hint for that. Uh, moon person is not a person. Fantastic. It's a door. It's a door. Okay. Wait, where am I? This leads here? Yeah, I definitely right. have the game gets fun now. As now, as now the game is fun. What'd you get? So now the game is fun. Uh, I just got the um, 
What's it called? You know, the what's it called? Bubble steel? No. Uh, the up Fire slash. Up slash. Oh, air slash, yeah. Is there a way to get that any faster? You think? No. You, you require the bubble. Okay. Oh, wait, I've been here. Yeah, I've been here. This is where the rude blue slime is that had the sword. A really annoying backtrack. Just thought of one bit of art rather than a door. Ah, oh, okay. Yo, Cobalt, thank you so much. It was incredibly kind of you. Thank you so much for four months in a row at Tier 3. Supports the stream, supports sick kids. You're just, you're such an awesome person. I'm glad to know you. That is pretty awesome. go through a doorway here. Remember, where's the double jump again? Where's the feather? How am I not remembering where the feather is? Uh, the feather is to the right of the village. Yeah, but it's to the um, right of Atlantis, uh, underwater right? underwater village. Yeah. I'm just, I'm, I'm missing it somewhere. I just found a heart container that I didn't know existed. Nice. 35,000 gems. Not gonna buy it. Oh, yes. That was the one we were talking about. Yeah, that's not cheap. Nope. I actually just picked that up for real. Because <laughs> I was wandering through here and I'm like, hey, I've got some spare money. Well, the feather split has some, some room for improvement on it. Gonna just put that out there. Right of the village. There's not an upper to the right? No? No? I'm just an also, idiot. I just realized I am also an idiot. Moondory. Uh, I was I was trying to do one of these trials uh, that was probably requiring the um, bubble shield without the bubble shield. Oh, I yeah. keep forgetting it floats. Yeah, it's it's easy to forget. I gave up on it so quickly because I was like, there's no way this is possible with what I have. Uh, no, please split. Thank you. Now to get back to a save point as quickly as possible. Did I not get the... Well, first thing first. One short. How did I not get the wall? I didn't go down the thing! I'm an idiot. Oh, yeah, that can be really easy to miss, I'm sure. Yep. Well, I think that I found another place where I can improve my time. time coming up. <laughs> Hopefully that's basically everywhere at this point. I'm trying to at least, you know, make it not obvious you're an idiot time improvements, though. Yeah, Cobalt, this this came out like less than a month a ago. Weeks ago. Yeah, like right before uh, SGDQ. Oh, so close! Alright. To Lumen Castle then. Got him! Nice. 
figured out where to where to do the moon? No, not yet. I went through the, the I'm going through the trial again. Uh, oh no. I wasn't supposed to do this anyway. I'm supposed to go get the moon, actually. It's fire and blue. What is blue? Oh, flea is the yeah. yeah. The jump. It's the best. First, I need to go to Forgetting the upward slash is, uh, yeah, Omega, this, like, upward slash is the flea attack. Like, flea something. Yeah, it's the flea scroll. Oh, whoops. Respawning that room. Yeah, this game is super fun. Like, I blind raced it last night, and I had to play it again today. Yeah, I didn't even finish the blind race last night, and I really wanted to play it again today. <laughs> Alright, so next time, uh, the forest village is actually a better work. That's good. Well, no, because next time I'm just gonna get the wall. Yeah, I know this is a side thing that probably isn't all that important, but... Which? I, uh, the, um, the trials with the, like, bird statues and stuff. Uh, it helps. Like, it's... The, the scroll that you get is nice. I would say, of all four scrolls, it's the least important. Oh, there's only four scrolls? Yeah, I mean, look in your inventory. Oh, I thought there were five slots. Oh, no, I guess there's only four slots. It lines up with the rings. Uh, I am in a call with Rogue Link, who is just awesome, and everybody should also be following. Hello. Oh, shit. Yeah, this is always the part where, not uh, not this trial, but this particular section where I'm like looking for the door, because I'm trying to remember everywhere I haven't been. Yeah. go by just holding the button. Because <laughs> that'd be really mean if you couldn't. to DC Bartlett, you say hi. It's true. <laughs> I do say hi to many people often. So in case there was any uh, any question as to the um, the homage that was being paid to Wonder Boy, so we just had yellow snakes and goblin archers. Yo, PC Bartlett, thank you very much for the. Phone. We've got much our green-haired adventurer dude looking all cool outside of the bar. I don't have a reason to go in the bar yet, but uh, whenever I do go in that bar, uh, you will notice that we've got... Come on. If you're going to damage me, damage boost me the right way at least. Uh, we've got oh, a oh, pig oh. as the barkeep, which is just real good. That is pretty good. That whole area is basically a giant reference. Yeah. A uh, couple in Silver Star and DC Bartlett. Thank you all for the follow. Yeah. 
Okay, I'm gonna come back here later. Again. I got one room further, that's good enough. Why would I read that? I feel like I fairly thoroughly explored those oh, no. tunnels now, but now I'm not sure. Media Magna, thank you very much for the follow. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and go heal now. <laughs> Pardon me. <laughs> what happened? Don't want to talk about it. <laughs> oh no! I, I walked into the volcano having forgotten to put on my armor. Does that, like, how quickly does that damage you? Uh, I'm you real that. hurt now. <laughs> Wouldn't recommend it. How long were you in there? Two seconds. The the screen was <laughs> flashing red, and I, and I immediately noticed that that seemed bad. Um, and wouldn't you know it, I was correct. That was bad. Is there anything else? Yeah, the, the sequence of events for me was something along the lines of, uh, I got the armor first, and then remembered an NPC saying that it was hot. And then I realized I wasn't taking any damage, and then checked the description of the armor. It was like, oh, oh hey, that's convenient. No, it's it's super duper a uh, reference to Wonder Boy 3's dragon armor. Oh yeah, it makes sense. That's why I was. That's where the thought came from in the first place. At least for me. Oh come on, let me. Look, I just want to go to the place where dudes are gonna murder fight. Just let me go. Of course. I may have found the moon door. Okay, cool. I'm happy for you. Yep, there's the shell. Oh, hey, wouldn't you look at that? The screen not flashing red anymore. So, you know what the funny thing about this is? No, but you're gonna tell I me. I never scrolled the screen left in this room. Oh, no. I only saw the star in the other thing. I never saw the moon. At least I don't remember seeing the moon. Oh, that's funny, though. Also, I have no idea what I'm gonna spend all this money on. What's over here? Just plants. Okay. Right. So, sword. Down, right, left, down, right. So, yeah. Down. Yep. Okay, so. I see, I see where this plot's going. Now the big moment of truth. We're gonna find out whether or not that monkey has a has a regenerated right, left, right, right, down code every game. Uh, left, right, 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 down. Yeah, yeah. It's the uh, that's the same for me as well. So I wouldn't be surprised if you don't need to. Yeah, nope. Uh, you don't. You don't have to talk to the monkey ever. Yep. Yeah, this this whole trading quest is just coming together now. <laughs> doing this whole thing very quickly once you have the, the fire ability. So you have the fire ability? The portals. Oh. Uh, because you need that for the star. Yep. Yeah, I've already and routed I, all those out. Yeah. Yeah, I figure you're between you the feather. Know all of this. I'm just saying this yeah. out loud. Oh, yeah, thing. yeah. Yeah, between the feather and... That I ever went right here. Yeah, I did. Did I? You got the thing. Boy, I wish I had all this money when I was grinding. Yeah, that's for just a quick way off. Let's go.
I don't have a... I'm probably not going to level up in here, so that's a bummer. So much money! Oh no, I don't have what I need! I mean, I shouldn't be surprised, but I'm kind of surprised. Yeah, you need the you need the lightning thing first, don't you? Um, the lightning thing. The purple blocks with um, the purple blocks. I'm guessing you need air for that. Mm, yes. Sorry, I took the No, it's it's good. I was being incredibly vague. Okay. But that makes sense, though. I have to get through the air temple before I can actually get the ultimate armor. Yeah. I was really hoping that would be the case. Yeah, sorry, friend. I have bad <laughs> news. <laughs> well, that was a real roundabout way to find that out. <laughs> oh, well. At least now I know. And, like, I finally solved the mystery of the moon. <laughs> The mystery of the moon. I like that. That's a good way to put it. I am a sucker for alliteration. Looks like I'm just gonna have to power through here. <laughs> I've got the best stuff that I can, so let's just go. Who are you fighting? Uh, I'm just trying to get to the air temple at this point. Okay. I was really hoping that since uh, I had access to the person who could upgrade my angel armor that I could finish the quest. You can. Can't you? Well, because I can't get to the fountain. Can you not? Because I'm, I'm... Unless I'm misunderstanding the last point of this trade quest, I handed in the... Um, You're right. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, I got the star, or I got the sun, which you... Which I opened the door, and I need the air thing in order to get through, and I assume that's going to give me something to hold the holy water. Yep. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're totally correct. I forgot about that part. But yeah, that's what I was trying to do. I was like, oh, I talked to this person. Now I just need to... I, I see them. Now I just need to do the thing. Unfortunately, the thing that needed doing was uh, me sucking it up and going through the level anyway. There's a level. Level sure would be nice right now. Actually, these... Bows hogs might give me a level. Bows hogs? Yeah, that's the name of the Sonic uh, Bowser. Oh Bowser. yeah, Bows hogs. Yep, yep, yep. Ah uh, yes, GTF. This is very, very Wonder Boy, and I think it's incredible. It's like. What this game makes me think of is if Wonder Boy was made on the Game Boy Color with slightly more graphic fidelity. Well, maybe more than slightly. But with, like, the audio is very Game Boy Color to me. I, I would say that the audio still feels more Master system to me. Oh, okay. I guess it's... I guess I'm not very familiar with, um the master system, like, how games sound and stuff, but a lot of the audio references and stuff they seem to be making are, at least the ones that I'm recognizing, are Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Zelda tunes. That's fair. Like, Seasons and Awakening, that kind of thing. Also, thank you for the bits, DC Bartlett. Also, yes, the, the temple music striking a Zelda 2 chord 
uh, is that that's not a unique statement. <laughs> more. 500 more experience and I will get my full heal, which I dearly need. Dope. Also, I'm not gonna lie, I'm probably going to get the air elemental thing, bail out immediately, get the ultimate armor, and come back. Yeah, that's what I have routed into the run. Oh yeah? Makes it's, sense. It's just faster. You're also getting an LADX uh, feel from the music, yeah. Um, there's some spots where, at least to me, that it feels a lot like Link's Awakening DX, but there's some spots where it's almost exactly like Seasons or Ages. Yeah, the the last bits of the trading quest are super fast once you have the yeah. I mean the, the moon feather. Thing. Oh, yeah, the, the feather. Because everything you need to trade in after the moon is just right next to a teleport spot. Phew. Oh no, this chest is taking forever! Oh no, I need to skip the dragon. So place. much money! Does it ever stop? Wow. I really wish that I went further into this temple, but I'm not sure if I could have without what little armor I have. <laughs> big money, big prizes. Oh, I love it. Whoop. Yeah, especially with how this dungeon's laid out, it's very it looks like it's very fast to just blitz through with your uh air item. Yeah, it's, it's obviously set up for you to be able to make good use of the dash. And that's the boss. Yeah, the fire spell's real neat. I really like it. It's a neat mechanic. Oh, I'm, I'm not at the boss yet. I just noticed the boss door. Is it just a uh, recolor of the first boss? What's that? The fire skull. Or wait, oh, are or are you talking about the first boss? We're we're talking about the yeah the, the first fire. I said the fire oh. spell is really cool. Oh, fire spell! I heard fire skull. Oh no. And you said that right after I was talking about finding the boss door. So I thought you were talking about a boss. No, sorry, I was responding to chat. Oh no, you're you're cool. Yes, Lord Zerk, the, uh, the air item certainly lets me blow through the dungeon. Wah -wah. Nice. Also, Minotaurs really hurt! Did you get to see Smash TV at SGDQ? I did not see Smash TV at SGDQ. I missed that one as well. Aw, oh, looks like I can't. Oh, the purple blocks are helping you. Like that. Is this... Yes, this is... Oh, here's a new area. Start of the dungeon. Oh my god, you are the most annoying enemy when you're walking away from me. Please come Ooh. here, refill my magic. I would have preferred you drop a heart. dedicated button, so I assume it's it's pretty fancy. I know that I'm not going to beat this boss first try, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish the boss puzzle, and then go purchase new healing items. I need... Yeah, 
smash, hold the direction, and you shine spark. Got it. <laughs> So fast! I'm Sanic. Actually, no, I'm gonna death warp out of here. What am I doing? Why am I playing this game when I could be death warping to the end? I'm dead. I'm not dead. Oh man, lining up sprints in this is gonna be really neat. Is in this dungeon. That's right, there's this now. Let's go! <laughs> Gotta go fast! Right. Yeah, we finally got the speed upgrade. Yeah, the speed upgrade definitely comes kind of late in this game. I'm doing a terrible job controlling it, though. Oh, duh! God, I'm... It's almost like I've only played this game once before, but... Oh, I ran out of magic! I want to swap where my uh, my air is. Maybe put it on L instead of uh, R. I'm gonna buy a big potion anyway. We got the thing. Hey, 7 Mark 7, how's it going? Yeah, so it does it does remember your previous state through all screen transitions, including air dashing. Yep. Oh, but that's interesting. If you're on the ground, though, it will use another dash if you're holding down the button. Ooh, that is interesting. So, let's see. Do you have to hold down the button to sprint? No. You don't. Okay. You just you pick that up speed and you keep easier. that speed. Nothing good armor. Looks good. Ha! Bless you. Oh, excuse me. Ha! Oh. Oh wow! Right. Is this a safe area? Bells Hog, ah. who I just decided to take a D-boost through. Oh, joy. I have to fight Pazuzu. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh no, I used my one flea attack already. <laughs> This might be, this is almost certainly my first death, if I do it now. This is okay, we can walk back. You failed! What a disappointment. Wow. He's mad. Oh yeah, it took me two tries to kill him. Once you figure out the pattern, he's super easy though. Yeah, he seemed, he seemed pretty easy. Yo, uh, where are the boys? Was... How's it going? I was thinking I could uh, iframe dash through him, but it's not worth the damage. I don't want to use my... Alright, well now we're definitely just like... going back. Hi, me again. This is really good. I'm having a ton of fun with it. Enough to pick it up as a speed game. Okay, I need to figure out how to dodge his actual attack. Not just the tornadoes. Yeah, the tornadoes are real obvious, but once... I, I will tell you that that is an attack pattern that once you figure it out, it's nothing. I'm sure. Oh dear. Come on. Which is actually kind of funny. Whatever I was doing the first time through was more correct because I lasted way longer the first time. <laughs> no, you got this. Easy. Oh yeah. I'm Easy sure. game. He doesn't. He doesn't seem that bad. His sprite is also pretty awesome. Yeah, Gom is. It's a fun fight. It's a cool boss. I love this intro. I love this boss's intro. so greedy on the first fight, because I was clearly doing something correctly. What's throwing me off is you get exactly one flea attack, and that's it. Yeah. Rocco Riquette, thank you very, very much for the host. Welcome, everyone. <laughs> that boss is the most Wonder Boy ass sprite in the whole game. Yeah, you're not wrong. Alright, death number one. Goody. Oh my god. Good start. Let's, uh,. Let's just go ahead and fix that, shall we? The fact that you can double pause is really annoying. Double pause? Yeah. So if you... At least I've been, uh... Pausing twice, I guess? I don't know. I was doing something and it just goes to a black screen and never actually goes to the pause menu and just comes right back out. I wonder if that's what off was having to happen. Maybe? Hard to say.
if you fail enough times, you want to start cracking random gems. Fair enough. I actually have the pattern now, so that's good. I keep getting baited by the tornadoes, though, which is no point now. I'm sure I'll have them this time. I, although my problem, my problem is that I, I found an elixir and I don't want to use it because I know how expensive they are. So I should probably just use it. Hold right. Which means this game is basically Super Mario World. Yep, pretty much. Well, any Mario game. <laughs> So the, the connection I wasn't making is I was I was thinking my air dash was giving me iframes, but no, it's just stopping my horizontal movement briefly. Yeah. Yeah, now I now I've got it. Oh man, I really hope there's an achievement for just surviving this guy for a really long time. Am I sure this isn't just Wonder Boy? No, honestly, I'm not. <laughs> Actually, I, I wonder how long it would take. Because you are rock this game is falling. super fun. It is one million percent worth it. Oh, and yeah, yeah this, this is a new game, uh, Guguma. It's what, 15 bucks? Yeah, I think so. Whoa! Big tornadoes. Yeah, that happens. Don't care. I'm just gonna tank my way through this. Okay, so next up comes trials. Stop. Okay. Game. Please just pause. Can you not pause on this boss? Yeah, you can. Okay, then my game is glitched. Which is a shame, because I got you... down to five I health. don't know if you can, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Okay, maybe you can. Because, yeah, when I, when I played the first time, I didn't have any items because I was an idiot. <laughs> yeah, I, uh... I mean, that's on me. I was getting greedy because I thought I had a heal in the tank, but yeah, I just couldn't actually pause. That explains that, though. I was having a little trouble dodging the, uh, the large tornado, so I decided to just tank it because I knew I had another whole hit point, uh, whole another, you know, yeah. set of hearts. And then I couldn't pause, and I'm like, this is a problem. Yeah, that would make it tough. I'm sure I'll get him this time, though. I'll just have to be way less greedy in that second phase. But yeah, this is a pretty easy fight once you know the trick. Smart. 
Thanks, Omega. Yeah, I know I can do it. I just need to get back into the rhythm I had last fight. Close. You know, Baron of Bones with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you so much. Since it looks like we've got a bunch of new folks, just a, a reminder, all the money from this stream. Um, from ch cheers, from subs, everything goes to the Extra Life uh, donation drive. I'm super bad. Linked in the stream info. So, everybody shut up, Baron of Bones. Give them some love. They're supporting me, making me feel real happy. Supporting the stream, but... Also helping sick kids. And how freaking cool is that? That is pretty freaking cool, I gotta admit. Speaking of which, Daiko! I hope that you're doing well, my friend. Hate this room. Okay. Ah. Uh, yeah, I cannot figure out how to get around those large. No. Trees. Sorry. Just. I'm in the Goodbye. trials. The trials are real great. Which one's the trials? Uh, where you get the, um, the, uh, woodpecker. Woodpecker? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm surprised you're doing that one. Uh, it, it just melts bosses. Oh, okay. Wait, is that the circle one? Yeah. Oh, okay, I thought that was the... I thought they, you guys were saying that was the Shoryuken attack. No, the, I'm sorry. You said circle. I heard quarter circle. I was thinking. Um, oh, okay. Hadouken. But yeah. it's really good against bosses? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's really, really difficult for me with an uh, analog stick. And this... I am one of the people that's having the problem with this game not recognizing D-pad input. Yeah, I'm surprised that it straight up didn't recognize my Wildcat, and it's partially recognizing your S Xbox One yeah. controller. That's so weird. Yeah, I can see that, Ivy. I, I think that it's probably worth it. I'm going to play around with it later, but for now I'm going to stick to the the boss strats that I have uh, memorized, which... That was good. Yeah, I don't really want to install Joy to Key. Especially because... Yeah, you don't have to. Yeah. Of course, I say that, and I'm messing this up, like, a million times in a row, so... Is the, um... Is the room where you have to pogo all over all the enemies the last trial? I don't know. I think so. Are you there right now? Not right now, but that's where I got, and oh, then I decided to move on. Yeah. It's the only one in the original, or in my original playthrough that took me more than, like, a minute and a half. And right now, I'm just, I'm losing, losing my down. Oh, that's pretty bad. This room is, honest to God, super cool and really fun. If I was playing on a D-pad, this would be great. That's the only really rough part, is that one up slash is real bad. And then right at the end, it's easy to, to lose the room. See that? That's it's entirely because of me. Come on! Come on! Come on! No! He has one bar left. I take it, Gom just killed you. I 
not gonna lie, he was down to like four bars. I started tanking him because I still had an herb to go through, and he killed me anyway. <laughs> yeah, he does a lot of damage. You don't want to do that. It seemed fine. Mathematically, it almost worked. <laughs> I think it's because I tapped his body a few too many times, which I think is more damage than tornadoes. I'm not sure. I don't think that I ever took a body hit from him. I'm not sure. The worst yeah, I think one was game. two hearts. Welcome, one was everybody. Three I hope that you're all having fun watching me do the same thing 17 times in a row. <laughs> that number's way too small. I know, I know that feel. If only I had a potion! <laughs> Alright, there we go. They probably realized it'd be way too easy with a potion. Plus, it's a trial, so it makes sense. Oof. Uh, D-Rock, I also have an 8-bit dough. I didn't love it. But mostly because I'm really particular about my SNES controllers. Because the vast majority of the speedruns that I do are Super Nintendo. Take 19, go. Ouch. This is one of those areas where... Once the... Yeah, no, this, this room is definitely a troll. But once you get it, it's really cool, and you feel real good. And it's like, after this, all of the other trials are a breeze. Yeah, most of the trials seemed pretty straightforward, as long as you, you know, get the gimmick. I'm getting rocked by this stupid bird. God, I'm... Analog controls, man. Analog controls. I'm supposed to up slash, down stab, up slash. Dodge those large tornadoes. Well, more accurately, he, like, doesn't accurately tell you where they're coming up. Yeah. Make Mac attack for a year in a row. Thank you so, so much. Hashtag doing the same thing 20 times. Yeah. I'm so bad at this. That particular room? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm guessing you're getting it right after uh, fire? Yeah. If it melts bosses, it's probably worth it. Yep. There we go. Jeez. It's so tough. Well done, Tina. Whew. One is so easy compared to phase two. 
I wonder if he's supposed to lie about where the uh, tornadoes are coming, or if it's supposed to be accurate. I feel like I didn't have that issue. Yeah, like I, I line up for um, I line up to the open space between the like giant bursts, and uh, it ends up being like halfway through the tornado. At least that's what it looks like. I could just be wrong, but... I mean, you've that's played a video game or two off. in your time. I feel, I, I feel like you probably... You probably know how to play a game. SOP, there we go! Finally! <laughs> Oof. Yeah, I just had to adjust myself to like 75-80% of the way through the telegraph, and then I dodged it every time. Hmm. I got the sword. I got the fancy stuff! Oh yeah. I even got an achievement. Oh, I know where that is. Okay. Actually Wow, two hundred. That's a lot of damage. Alright, let's start murdering things. Although the defense was only ten more, so I'm probably still gonna die a ton. The range on the attack is real good, so... That's not where we wanted to go either. Uh, we go mode, or is there still more stuff to do? I think this is as go mode as I'm gonna get. I'm not sure if there's other stuff, but at least for where I am in the game, I know exactly where I'm gonna go, and I know exactly what I need to do. Oh, this does so much more damage! Yeah, I guess that extra 10 defense is a lot. Yeah, the... When you consider how much attack helps, um, yeah, it, I, I feel like the numbers as they, uh, as they pertain to attack and the numbers that, as they pertain to defense, just don't match up with each other. That makes sense. You could play on a Super Nintendo pad, absolutely. In fact, I am playing on the Super Nintendo pad. Yeah, uh, it's four buttons total. But yes, uh, currently there are some issues with some controllers, and it doesn't appear to be consistent across people's computers. So it's real neat. Time for final boss battle? Not even close, unfortunately. Off. Well, I assume I've got to kill something in each of those tears, right? Uh, yes. I don't 
remember where the liar body is. I don't suppose you remember where you got it, Roguelin? Uh, the witch? The body. That is to the right of, um, the P-Town. Okay. It's way through the ice mountain, past the polar bears. And the string is That's in right. the... That's right. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting the string right now. It's in the basement. Yeah. That's right. There's fire... The ice block that can help. Yep. I like this tutorial room with uh, the dash. With all the arrows and stuff. Yeah. Well, it's it's really neat. Um, once you get to, there's a there's a spot. Yeah, I'm having trouble with the. Well, I'm gonna be attacked, but I think I got it. Yeah, there we go. I'm so glad I did all the side quests to to get this armor. <laughs> oh, sweet! I leveled up. Hey, Wakanda Hero. Someone you're watching stream just gave me a shout out. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, who was it? I definitely need to thank. Them. Where? Out of the dungeon. <laughs> Home as in not here. Yeah. Home is where I'm not right now. <laughs> Sounds like we're gonna have a thunderstorm tonight. Hey, soldier guy. Glad to see you're still well. Bye, soldier guy. Man, I sure hope nothing happens to him. He's my favorite. You know, I hear he's close to retirement. Today's his last day. <laughs> yeah, Media Magnet, I got I got stuck in, in your neck of the woods for like four hours when I was flying home on Friday. sword itself does more damage than your sort of projectile? Uh, yes. It does. Maybe. <laughs> it seems to. I wasn't sure how much you tested it yet. I think that the thing is that when you hit with your sword, you also, um, you also hit with your projectile. Mm, that makes sense. That's a lot of G. Oh, apparently I have uh, got an achievement for 100,000 money. Nice. Congrats on the money, friend. I do love me some money. That can be exchanged for goods and services. So I hear. So I hear. There we go. Don't care, just me over. Oh dear. This also explains why you were fine with dropping so much money on those loot motions. Because I don't, I can't think of anything else I want to spend money on right now. Yeah, pretty much. Hyper 
Ah, yeah, it's Hyper Beam. Yeah, but why is Hyper Beam? That is a very good question. I mean, it's a golem, so... I don't know, I got nothing. It's a golem that looks like an onyx. For, but whatever it is, I want to melt that ice block. One, two, three, four more fires. That my original playthrough, not getting it now. Uh, damage boost or something? No, it, it's obviously a secret area. I'm willing to bet that it's a heart. If anything, it's probably just a Oh, wait, are you in the ice yeah. area? Yeah, the secret thing to the left. Uh, where you break, break the ice block and have to do some fancy jumping? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that is, that is just a heart container. You say just. Have you seen the final boss? <laughs> Fair. I like how so long as you jump, attacking doesn't slow your momentum at all. Mm. So how many heart containers do you have routed in for this first run? I uh, don't know, actually. Right now I have 12. Okay. Yes, T is good. Soldier dude! Oh no, soldier okay? dude, that doesn't look good. Uh oh. Is, is he gonna be is he gonna be alright? I think he can take this dude. I think he's okay. He looks kind of afraid. No, they can smell your fear, soldier dude. <laughs> oh, rip! Smell you will be fear. missed, soldier dude. You will be missed. So, uh, who do you think is the best character in this game? Adventure Friend or Soldier Dude? Oh, Adventure Friend is definitely better than Soldier Dude. I'm sorry, <laughs> there's just... There's no... There's no competition there.
Hey, Princess Asu. This is Agalos, which is a new game uh, as of like this month. That is obviously a uh, extreme homage to the Wonder Boy franchise. It's real good. Easy to recommend. Oh, Tina, I also noticed something else that you might find important. Yes, go on. Um, hitting with your, like, projectile attack off of your sword does not restore your magic. Yeah, I noticed oh, that. that. Only hitting point, with like... the sword proper does. Here, go in the middle. I'm sure nothing wrong will happen. Nothing bad will happen. It's a what? It's a two pigeons. They're very brightly colored. Oh, yeah. It's still four. Four is still not two. That's right. Oh, this boss stage is clever. There we go. Oh, almost. Oh, snap! Bullet hell. Super easy to just tank that boss with uh with the ultimate armor. Oof! Oh, that was that was real bad. Wasn't paying enough attention. Uh oh, that Dead doesn't sound two. good. I died to Yakra of all things. Is that the Tower of Babel boss? Yeah. Okay. I got the windy thing. Gosh, stop. It's very I, rude. I feel like I'm making progress. Yeah, Windy thinks I progress. I actually beat this game before you. <laughs> Honest to God, it's going to come down to the last boss for either of us. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> it's okay. I had a four-hour head start. It's fine. I'm also up to 16 hearts. Yeah, 16 hearts. So I feel like I'm pretty close to the end, though, right? Like I'm, I'm You're guessing I get there. the element of, I'm guessing I get the element of light, and then have to go through all the rifts. Yep. That is that is literally exactly what happens. Yes. God, this dude was such a pushover in my blind run. Actually, when uh when I first started this game, I was expecting this elemental guy to, to turn people like immediately. Well, not immediately, but as soon as I gave them the elements. Now we can cross the cracks that lead to the darkness. Where are all there of these? Go. That's as easy as I remember it.
Yeah, I wonder if, um, how much more DPS the fire portals do over everything else. Because it does a lot of hits, but I wonder how much, uh, it's actually doing. Yeah, I don't know. Oh I wow, I am gonna get the lightning boss. sword. Let's see how this goes. I was not expecting to get the lightning sword, and yet here we are. Could you not? Oh, right. Uh, I think that I'm gonna change the... I think the GZS split is just gonna be when I leave the tower. That makes sense to me. Yeah, this game is really good about giving you a reasonable amount of money. So you... Oh, not needed. It's this way, I forget. Oh, right. I'll be back. This guy's hands were uh, attackable. I need to figure this guy out. How many rifts are there? Four? Five? Just two that matter. Really? Just two? Yeah. I thought there were a lot more than that. Or are there a bunch of them, but you only need to kill, like, a handful? Uh, it sounded like there were more, but I'm not 100% certain of that. Okay, because I know of two off the top of my head. The one in the castle and the one that I'm in right now, next to the fireplace. Okay. fireball attack a lot more than I am. Yeah, I've been not in the habit of doing that, but... Well, because it's your one really good ranged attack. So I, I imagine it's, it's a good thing to be in the habit of, you know, launching, because you can dodge while it just travels through the air. Because yeah. it's not super fast, but it's fast enough to get there, you know, before the thing moves. Whatever you're attacking. Yeah. In okay, some animations, I, it doesn't let you know. Because I, I can't... I'm, like, standing still trying to pause, and I'm having the same problem I did on the... on the coast. Or on Zuzu. That's not good. Do you remember being able to heal on these, uh... Yes, the birds. Okay. So... I don't know, maybe I should restart the game. Yeah, it sounds like reset time. I'll better get to an actual save, and then, uh... Can I, can I leave these dimensional portals once I'm in here? What do you mean by that? Just, like, exit them instead of killing the boss. Uh... I think so. Pretty sure. Pretty sure you can just walk left. Okay, walk left, that makes sense. Hey, 
Hey, Arctic, how's it going? Oh no, all of my things missed. Except this game, the darkness attacks you with magic missile. Nice. Okay. Okay, yeah, you can just go left. I don't know why I didn't think of that. Oh, you bought an SD to SNES and SNES? Nice, Arctic. That's awesome. Hmm. Hmm. Huh. Sounds like you're having a little trouble over there, Tina. That was a neat glitch. Uh-oh. Uh, everything okay over there? We're good. Took a death. It's fine. Yeah, Not sure how I'm supposed to feel about that one. <laughs> gonna, gonna be real honest with you, that was a bit of a head-scratcher. Sounds like not a good time. It wasn't a not good time. Let's see oh, wait, no, that was too here. few double negatives. It wasn't not a not good time. There we go. Got there. <laughs> Nailed it. Got it. Easy. Yeah, cause, Easy game. Because if I have a glitch where I can't pause on the final boss, I will be very upset. I guess let's try this again. Actually, I want to see what the one in the uh, castle is. I also wanted to see if I could just go through this. I probably can. But I want to know what it says. Specifically trying to go into his tower, uh, like, right now. I'm just wondering if I can do it. There's a thing down there. I wonder what it is. Let's go find out. Yeah, okay. Can't do anything. Okay. Not surprised. Man, there's gonna be some sweet movement tech after you get air. With just like the flea jumps and stuff. Yeah. Uh, let's head to the castle. You know, I have. I, I'm of two minds about the, uh, the whole. Once you lose enough health, you no longer have um, the projectile thing. Uh-huh. And? On, on the one hand, it's, like, really cool. Like, it's, it's a good... It's a good idea. On the other hand, not okay. <laughs> Yeah, it's one of those things where it's a, it's an excellent risk-reward mechanic. Yeah. But, on the other hand, if you make it more than just, like, a tiny bit of damage, then it feels incredibly punishing to not have it. Yep. And otherwise, why do you have it? Because it's not doing much. Yep. So it feels like a lose-lose either way. But it is super cool to just always have it. Yeah, just don't get hit, you idiot. Actually, that death is okay. Yo, John Carls. This is the Tina Hex stream. Wait, the John Carls? I know. He's in my chat. Isn't that the permanent co-host of the Frame Savers? <laughs> wow. <laughs> All joking aside, anybody who doesn't know John should give him a follow. Um, anybody who doesn't know... The frame savers should definitely check the frame savers out because it's real it's, good. It's pretty awesome.
Oh, I keep trying to set up some really good portals. John, you were playing Rando at the time. Not my fault, buddy. <laughs> oh, it's time for Adventure Buddy. Everyone loves Adventure Buddy. Let's go, Adventure Buddy. We're going to adventure. Keep me from doing any of the things that I like to do, so thank, thanks for that. You're really helping out. I can't pause on bosses. Can you pause out of bosses? Okay, there we go. Jeez. I guess I was just doing something weird? I don't know. Okay, I can I can actually pause to get healing now. That's that was good. so weird. Yeah, that does sound weird. I don't know where I am. Oh, now I know where I am. Well, this is bad. Oh, yeah, the, the portals are definitely the way to go on these bosses. Or, at the very least, of what I have access to. I don't have the Shuriokin yet. That's fine. But they, they're really good. Seal has weakened. Swag Portal Finisher. They just do a lot of damage. Yo, BD Weasel, how's it going? Oh, wait, I have all the stuff. I should go try to kill that, uh, bonus, uh, bonus mouse. Good luck. I'm sure I will need it. <laughs> I'll give him a couple of attempts without healing items first. Uh, just to learn the patterns and such? Exactly that, and I really don't want to spend 25000 on a full heal. Yeah. At least the bosses give you, like, a ton of money, though. The big potion is one row, right? What do you mean? Uh, ten hearts? I don't know, actually. That sounds right, but... What do I know? I let go, Mouse. Good luck. Uh, Rathwell, yeah, I beat the game last night. It was real fun. Definitely a, a strong recommendation. Agreed. Oh, man. That is a tight jump. Wait, I have a thing for this! I keep forgetting everything but fire and compact. I mean, to be fair, fire is pretty awesome. It's easy to forget everything else. Fire is pretty awesome. You know, I miss Soldier Friend. I mean, yeah, the jump sprite is is pretty obviously a uh, homage to Shantae. The jump sprite? For the uh, adventure buddy. Oh, for, yeah, that makes sense. I, I'm 
I'm gonna deal with that mouse later. But it's definitely dying before I fight the final boss. Oh no, let's find out how much a big potion heals. Because the difference between a big potion and an elixir is just so much. Yeah, it's a lot of money. But a full heal up to like 20 hearts is pretty crazy. So I see why it's expensive. You also have a ton of money, so... No, there's several puzzles in the game that force you to do that, so... Oh, yeah, yeah, for, like, the puzzles and stuff. I just mean, like, in combat, so you can dodge and lay a portal down. Oh, I just... I don't... I don't use the fire portals at all. They seem to do a decent amount of damage. I know the, um, one of the dark seal bosses just absolutely got ruined by it. I'm gonna try it on the other ones as well. Fair enough. But if the Shuriokin is your like go-to damage dealer, then I don't see what fire. figure out is how easy it is to like curve the portal path and really get a lot of exposure. Uh, I don't think that it ever curves, does it? Uh, it it kind of has a weird movement to it. Okay. It's not always the straightest line. Yo, another boss down with fire portals. Nice. And I'm level 16. And I have a lot of money. <laughs> I am not level 16. Is this it? Or is there one more? Nope, that's it. Hi, Tina. I'll see you on the other side in like an hour. Oh, is it time for, uh... I think it is. <laughs> oh, don't worry. You've got an easy boss first. Oh, easy boss, then, dip, then hard boss? Yeah, it's easy, then impossible. That's the way it goes. <laughs> I'm gonna have to use my elixir. Unless I can get. Yo. Easy game. This is a pretty sweet dungeon theme. Oh, are you in, uh, Val whatever? Yeah. I 
Oh wait, I don't have anything for anything. Shoot. Hey, I don't have anything for anything. <laughs> That's yeah, fine. I love the, I love the that starts us now. over at the start of this without any damage taken, so this is fine. Uh, Rogue Link is the other person on stream. Hello. Definitely give him a follow. He is a A plus speedrunner. That's what a game dev, just a smart and kind human being. Aw, thanks. I don't think I'm going to do Later. the run back today, but I'm definitely doing the run back sometime this week. Austin Spafford, thank you very much for providing that link. Yeah, I love the, um, I love the, like, natural relationship between how much health an enemy has and the puzzles of the room. Because you've only got so uh, so many enemies in a room, and so much magic, even if you do have a ton. Oh, there we go. Ike Blue, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. This room is rude. I am looking forward to getting the save point at the end of this. And then flailing on the boss for five years. That was on purpose. Yo, Unikitten, how's it going? Uh, so the gold knights in the final dungeon, if you face hug them, there's totally a safe zone. Oh, neat. Yeah. Thought you'd like to know. Electronic logic, thank you for the follow. Mm, do I have vial first? No, I'm not first. In fact, I need to move this forward. Oh, I see what you do. Oh, wow. Okay, that's why. That's clever. I need more magic, though. Okay. I guess Lyle really was first, because I wasn't an idiot when I robbed this, and then I am now. What are you picking up? Uh, I am now going oh, to go no. get the vial. I'm dead. <laughs> oh, okay. Pick up the wall? Yeah, definitely. Thank you, Yuna, for the good luck on the first run. So far, it's going well. Game is super yeah, fun. Uh, probably should. No. Yes, I go up out of here. Refill. Oh. Uh, Austin Spafford, I found that it does really good damage versus bosses. Yeah, when I run back through and get the rest of the stuff, I don't know if I'm going to 100% on this particular save or whatnot, but uh, maybe I, I probably should just to like have an idea where everything is. Did uh, Melos end up getting all heart containers? Yeah, the only thing that Melos didn't get is uh, your rat friend. <laughs> ah, yes. Rat friend. You know, the friendliest friend. Hi, 
I should have a... I... I should have water before I come here. Dummy. Oh, did you go into the temple? Yeah. puzzles to get through this place. Yeah. I really enjoy all of this. <laughs> it's, this is a really fun <laughs> game. Can confirm is fun game. Curious for your routing. Did you grab the heart container um, to the left of Fyra Village? That one's pretty quick. To the left of Fyra Village? What's the heart container to the left of Fyra Village? Uh, you go through a fire gate. Or not a fire gate, a uh, metal gate. That's, that's a magic container. Is it a magic container? Yes. And yes, oh, okay. I do get that one because that is... Magic is real good. <laughs> yeah, it's... Well, in addition to being real good, it's also just... I need five magic. Okay, yeah, I forgot that was a magic container. Yeah. I honestly forgot where I got my fifth magic from. I knew I purchased one of them. Yeah, you purchase one in water pick the other one up near fire. I'm surprised you only have five. Still. Such a weird number. Yeah, I don't know where the, the last one is. I never found it in my playthrough. Alright, let's actually do this puzzle properly this time. sound like doing the puzzle properly at all. Huh? I said that didn't sound like doing the puzzle properly at all. <laughs> Can confirm was not the proper solution to that puzzle. button because I'm used to my old bindings. Done as in now? Okay. I will be right back, everybody. I gotta grab some laundry real quick. But stop doing that. Sorry. Stay tuned to uh, Tina panicking on this boss, and uh, I will be right back. <laughs> One pixel left. Hell yeah. Wait, no! Hell no! Oh no! That's okay. And we're using the elixir there too. That, that 
super sucks. I'm getting used to this new key binding. Or not key binding, but uh uh controller mapping. That's the words that I was looking for. Sad gal. Yeah, this game's real fun. Right, let's go. This time for sure. remember what my key bindings are. Big O, how's it going? I have returned. Welcome back. Bye, thank you. Did you kill that boss? Second time, literally no damage. Nice. That was a Pazuzu, right? Yeah. Okay. I'm never gonna learn that guy's actual name. <laughs> the Light Essence. Oh no. Okay, so Firefly button scroll, I will... Split. I've got to rework these splits, then. Just forgetting your route, or...? No, I... This was not me forgetting my route. This was me, uh, routing wrong. Oh, okay. So, can confirm. Uh, big potion is... Uh, ten hearts. This wild ride. Wow, that pink... You guys weren't kidding, that pink minion has way too much health. Yeah. yeah it's like the hardest dude in the game. I don't think anyone ever calls him anything. No. Besides, like, the credits. Well, let's start buying those elixirs. Oh boy.
Yeah, I'm not surprised. Like, I think they they are in Angelo. Well, no. It's what's the name of this game again? Is it Angelo? No, the the player character is never gonna wear a helmet. It'd screw up his glorious hair. <laughs> it is pretty glorious hair. I'm so used to Risky Shuffle, or like, Shantae Dash, I want to be more invulnerable than I actually am, so I just immediately get bodied by enemies. Yeah, that happens. This is really tough. I'm sure that there's a better way to do this, but this is how I did it in the game. Or in my, uh, blind playthrough. Which boss? Uh, not a boss. Oh, okay. The dashing room? Oh, the uh, downward switch? Yeah, if you have a way to do that one, I'd love to know. Uh, what did I do? So I'm using bubble, but it's really hard to get bubble. Oh, I just, I just pogoed. Probably not easier. I mean, I lose the dash, so it's probably pogoing. No, that's way easier. Oh, the pogo? Yeah. No. Yeah, because there is a little bit of time, even though you lose the dash. But the, if you time it right, the pogo... You no, I kept the dash. It. Yeah. With the pogo. Oh, well, yeah, what what I meant was I was able to uh, beat the puzzle losing my dash with a puzzle. Got it. And the timing was probably much tighter, but I think it's intended to, to be a normal attack. platform room is taking me the longest in this castle because I keep accidentally using a fire attack instead of an earth attack. So there seems to be a slight delay between uh, when you can, or when you air dash, and when you can um, flee attack. Hey, Yuna, thank you very much for the follow. Nice hanging out at SCVQ. There we go. Don't even care. Sure, I'll take it. Get through. Thank you for ordering the chow mein. Yeah. That was uh Do not order the chicken chow mein. Yeah, you you really you really don't wanna wanna find out. Yeah, Kin, he will have words with you.
tighter than it needs to be. I'm getting bodied by these floating eyes that are just happen that just happen to go in the right direction. You hate to see that happen. Have you tried skipping the bridge? You know, I tried skipping the bridge, and uh, didn't work out for me. Yeah, real weird. Usually that works. This is the, this is a really, really weird menu. What's weird? Just the menu in general. What? Oh, just it tends to drop inputs a lot. Thanks. When you try menu fast, yeah, sure does, sure does seem to. Got him! Nice. Whoever you just killed, congratulations. You're dead. Giant pink evil dude. Oh! Shortcut? Shortcut! Oh no. I needed that. Oh, that looks promising. Oh nice, he blocks you from going in the portal, that's pretty great. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's real great. Uh, I love that, that uh, boss intro. Yeah, this, um, his theme reminds me of Orcs from Seasons. I know that I've gone top. I can go down. Mid. You know, this super sounds like final boss music, too. Didn't have any resources, wasn't expecting to beat him that time. Got decently far though. Yeah, I was really hoping that I wouldn't have to go through this entire dungeon every time if I lost to him. making sure that you don't end up in that sort of situation. Oh yeah, definitely. I've been really, really pleased with the overall game design choices.
You know, one of these days I'm gonna get a fireball while running. And it's gonna be amazing. Basically, I want to get through that uh, purple tower to the right of uh, Kalulu without losing my run speed, but I don't know if it's possible. Did the same thing last time. Oh no! Yeah, Jaja and Jojo are like so easy. Yeah, they really are. They're the the birds, right? Yeah. I honestly wouldn't be surprised if theoretically every boss was that easy with the armor. It's not even about the armor, you just melt them down with the... Uh, or, yeah, with the... Because you need both pieces. With the woodpecker. Alright, let's murder this not final boss. So many times. How long did it take me to get Woodpecker this time? Still too long. You know, now that I think about it, I only have two sword abilities. one of them is, but I have no idea where the fourth one is. Yeah, you're gonna want I'm getting bodied by this form. <laughs> where is it, anyway? Like, I know where the trials are. I kind of feel like doing before I kill this boss. Oh, you found the, the uh, evil rat, huh? Congratulations. Huh? No, I, I, I found the evil rat a while ago. No, I'm talking to Melo who's in chat. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> um, yeah, where's the fourth scroll? Because I know where the trials are. Uh, how big a hint do you want? Uh, decent, I guess. 
Okay, uh, there is, there are four main areas, like four elements, and yep. there is one in each element. Yeah, that's fair. Uh... The thing about um, Firefly that makes me oh. convinced that that it's worth is that it um, it refills three of your of your things, and it melts Jaja and Jojo down super quick. Yeah, as as soon as you said that, I just remembered a. Uh air block that I didn't get around to breaking and forgot about breaking. Yes, yeah, so it on. seems really obvious in hindsight. It's like, there's one in each. Who would have thought? listen to what he was saying and where he was going. It was a real bad fight. his nest! Oh well. I think he said he'd visit your place? Okay, I'll check it out. Yeah, because I was going through the text no, expecting him to say something like a uh, hint. Free two day shipping. <laughs> yep, that is exactly what we got there. more reasonable price for a hard container. Ooh, elixirs are only 10,000 from him, too. That's super useful. Okay, now you're gonna tell me where he is. <laughs> I wasn't, um, I wasn't interested until that. Yeah, that's super handy. So, um, if retrace my steps. If you're in uh, the Sky Town, mm -hmm. and then you generally head down, um, like left and down, you'll end up seeing some air blocks to the right. Oh, and, then if yes. you, and if you air dash in that general direction, um, this video game. he'll yep. appear, and then you know, you, he'll I have found... really expensive stuff. And then you talk to him, and he sends you back to your place. And at your place, he has elixirs for ten thousand and herbs for two fifty. Yeah, it's funny that you say that because I found that dude, or I found that area in this playthrough. I had not found it in my blind playthrough. That's I just kind of like mentally filed it away. And yeah, now I need to find that bleed thing or the. 
Firefly, you said? Firefly? Firefly is the last one. really that hidden. It's it's hidden enough for me, apparently. <laughs> or I just have really bad luck exploring places. Yeah, because I totally forgot about the sword skills until, uh, until I was like, wait a second, I'm at the end. I should have all the things by now. <laughs> The problem is I'm not sure where I've gone and then I died and forgot to come back and where I've actually been. PC dialogue definitely hinted at something about growing a plant. This seems relevant to my interest. I was wondering why that NPC was there. It seemed completely random. Yeah, I don't know where to get the soil or anything like that. Though. You buy Wonder Boy the Dragon's Trap for Switch. Given that I have almost all the world records for that game, I feel like maybe I am not uh, the most unbiased person. <laughs> but <laughs> I will say it's real fun. Wait, I thought I was supposed to go this way. No. Yeah, water and soil. And I know where to get water. I'm not sure where to get soil. This was not a lo good location for a business. Holy shit. Yeah, I know, right? Please carry me. Just take me. Just... At least I can go get water now. We 
have water. Soil is a little more awkward, though. Probably nothing to the left. Eh, might as well find it. Okay, nothing to the left. But boy, was that neat. Okay, now actually looking for Flea this time. <laughs> I promise. Wait, are oh, you looking for uh, Flea or Firefly? Or Firefly. Uh, is it in the stormy area or the not stormy area? Uh, it's in the stormy area. Okay. That's where I was heading next. I was just wondering if I was absolutely blind again. Phase. Whoop. Every chest counts as 1%. Ooh. Oh, wow. 100% speedrun is going to be rough. What are one finds collectible dirt? It's like, yeah, there's all this dirt on the ground, but where's the good dirt? Where's the plot dirt? Where's the plot dirt? I like it. <laughs> Also, I just remembered that I have a top four. Whoops. Oh, there it is. I do not know how I missed that before. Oh, oh, I know exactly how I missed that before. Now that I think about it. Um... I fell down here, and then I got some, like, weird transition glitch, and it looked like I warped to a completely different area, but I had actually just jumped out before the zone fully loaded. So I actually, like, almost ran into where Firefly was really early on, and then just forgot to go back. That's worth having. Alright, let's go heck up a boss. Because I tell you what, Firefly is going to be way better than the fire uh, portals. Because they Movie do roughly or, the same thing. This game is so good. Oh, this game? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good.
Wait, does Firefly use a magic? Yes. Ah, that explains it. Yeah, the Downpour is such a good name for a final boss. Also, the music is just amazing. Sounds like you're about to pass me. I'm fighting the downfall right now. Oh, you passed me. <laughs> of course, I've wandered around trying to find it, so I'm not exactly surprised. Come on down, come on down, please. I'm concentrating so hard on this guy for them. Also, apparently someone's cooking a barbecue outside, and that is also very distracting. <laughs> Sounds like charcoal. Right. Time for Medio. Appreciate your confidence. It was not, not well founded. Whew. Hey, you made good time though. Well, also I have to be careful. Um, it does not default to whatever uh, save file you were on. And if I finish this game on this game on save file 2 uh, which is level 16 it's going to be an invalid run oh no yeah the last phase is super super hard it's really high i mean this whole fight is high stress I got the color glitch. Oh, nice. Yo! Made it all the way back to the purple... The, the purple power without losing any of my speed. Nice. Yeah, I haven't even triggered down four yet. I'm still working on the other guy. Oh, wait. I want to go back to the mine. I've got sheep on
So what, this comes in at about three hours a minute, right? Uh, yep. With lots to improve. I think this will be a sub-2 run. Like, not this run, but, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm at about 8 right now. I'm on the right side of the eye. That sucks. The train's just better on the left side of the eye. Oh no! Yo, Moogle. Thank you for the good luck. So I'm up to 17 hertz. I'm still getting bodied by these guys. Week one will be 230 to 240 and group down to about two in the next week or so. Yeah, that sounds about right. Let's go, let's go. Oh, is that it? Yep. Nice. 319.57. I've got time for another run. <laughs> well, hopefully I can finish these two bosses before you finish your second run. I just realized that I don't have to, to flea jump in order to get over these uh, oh, yeah. round lasers. Okay, I feel like I'm starting to... Uh, I'm starting to understand the, um, the way that you're supposed to fight the final boss. I feel like I got a really good rhythm that last one. Until nice. I started face tanking. I mean, obviously. Die! Yeah! A true hero emerges victorious. I must have beaten the final boss, clearly. Just 
Give me the teleport. That's all I want, is the teleport. <laughs> Thanks for the GG's, everyone. Hopefully it will be a better G after uh, I let the credits play out and uh, go get more to drink and such. But, oh wow, I yeah. got a lot of experience for that. Oh, did you kill Valiant? Yeah. Nice, congrats. You know what the best part of killing Valiant is? What? Downport? That save point that you're about to get. Oh, yeah. It's real nice. It's real good. <laughs> Melis, you're about to do some as well. Good luck. Oh, wait. I ran past my house. Oops. Actually, I wonder. Hi, Clue. Thank you for the GG. You know what? I might actually be able to make that. Hmm, maybe we not. I guess we're going to update the title from No Strat Speedrun Singular to Speedruns. To Single Strat Speedrun. <laughs> Only Strat. Go fast. Go fast. I right, see you, Melos. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, the second speed run's always super fun. For a while, I'm gonna start getting like gold after gold after gold, and these are and then okay. the golds dry up. I mean, yeah, eventually the gold stop coming. But yeah, the rapid fire golds are always feel good. Yeah. I mean, the first run's always real great because it's just, it's solid gold. It's a crap run. So, I mean, really, it's, it's more pyrite than gold, but gold. <laughs> it's pyrite. I mean, pyrite that's splits. a really good way to put it. It's pyrite splits. Should, I should I should make that a thing in um, in the split software that I'm writing. Oh, you're writing split software? Yeah, I I got tired of dealing with wine and slightly buggy uh, behavior as a result thereof. So I'm writing um, some split software that I can use alongside my. Um, What's it called? Thing that I suddenly lack words for. Uh, split software that I can use alongside uh, the layout software that I'm already using. So, it's getting there. Um, I think I'm done doing all the data type modeling, which means that things are going to fall in place pretty quickly, at least for the initial version. I am probably not going to talk much for the next hour or so. <laughs> Time for the downpour, eh? Yep. Okay, but isn't that the a, a really good badass boss fight? It's it's yeah. I was I was watching you do it, and I'm like, oh, I cannot wait for this. Have you played Wonder Boy in Monster World, uh, the I fifth Wonder Boy game, the first one on the Mega Drive? Nope. Oh my. I have I have only played uh, Dragon's Trap. Okay. So, uh, Wonder Boy 5, Wonder Boy and Monster World, whatever. Um, it, the tension that that boss fight creates is very similar to the tension that this one creates. So in that respect, I think it's a really, really good, um, it's a good homage to that. Nice. Because the, the last boss fight in Wonder Boy and Monster World, which I would love to watch you play bl uh, blind, by the way, is oh, okay. just... It's so tense, and it's so is, hard. Is it easy to get on emulator, or...? Uh, I mean, yeah, it's just a Genesis game. Well, I was wondering if there was, like, any problems with running it on emulator. Not as far as I know. Um, I've got a cart, but uh, when I was at GDQ, I didn't play this year. Or this GDQ, but at a GDQ, I took it on my um, 
Genesis Everdrive. You know, the more that I think about 100%, the more I think it's going to be a really neat speedrun. Since it's all chests, that means that the routing possibilities are going to be real interesting. Hmm. Well, I got to phase three without healing. Oh, nice. First try, so that's good. Yeah? I got to the start of phase three, though, so... <laughs> and then all of a sudden, minions. And then all of a sudden, the everything happened. Yeah. I find phase three to be the second hardest, other than the last phase. Yeah, the the I phase threw me off was a uh, way more difficult than I was expecting it to be. Yeah, the I phase is deceptively difficult. Um, yeah. And like phase six is just real hard. Oh, I thought it was only phase. I thought it was only four phases. No. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, oh you sweet summer I child. I have bad the, news uh, for you. Yeah, I guess I misunderstood two of the phase breaks when I was watching you. Uh, Melos, uh, other than a couple of these, I have mostly the names of, uh, things that I'm killing or things that I'm picking up. Uh, I have Basement Evil and Volcano Evil because I, uh, just didn't want to name the, the things. I wanted them to be slightly more descriptive. Uh, and then I also have Unleash Evil, I think in all caps, because that feels about right. Not Rip Soldier Guy? No, because that's not what I'm splitting. I'm not splitting on Rip Soldier Guy. I'm ripping on Unleashing... Or, I'm splitting on Unleashing Evil. Fair yeah. enough. Yeah, poor Night Guy. He needs yeah, to be in the credits. Guy. I hope he doesn't get shot. Well, he didn't get shot. <laughs> it's Ken that I'm worried about getting shot. Shoutouts to Ken. <laughs> Shoutouts to Ken. true. He tried. He tried his best. Also, I need to reorder my splits. Flowers are called Cosmos. Cosmos. Which, which flowers? The ones at the very start of the game. My headcanon is now that due to their name, they probably are spitting like, uh, like psychoactive dust. They're getting you high and that's what's doing the damage. Touch fuzzy, get dizzy. Yep. So my personal goal is to beat down four before I hit a hundred. That's fair. I'm at 81. No, we got B-Rank. Oh, we got B-Rank? Nice. Yeah. Is it time and percent? or? Just... I have no idea what the rank is calculated by. I haven't Googled it. I'm sure that the... Uh, I'm sure that they, they tell us. But who knows? But I'm a B-Rank. <laughs> 